Hey fam, welcome to Vlogmas. Today is actually a really exciting day. We are going to be getting a new dog. So like two years back, not two years back, girl, last year, both of our dogs had to be put down. I'm not really a type of person that talks about my pets or talks about dogs or animals, but last year we did lose both of our dogs and we haven't had a dog in about a year. So we're going to get a Frenchie, a blue fawn Frenchie. So we're gonna have a new family puppy and I'm so excited! The puppy is so cute. Um. We all decided on the name Nico. We've always had female dogs, but this is going to be, it's not going to be our first male dog because I remember when I was a kid, we had a little terrier, but he ran away. His name was Taylor. Shout out to Taylor. I don't even know if he's alive or not, but I had a Chihuahua and a Picadese that sadly passed away last year. My Chihuahua um, just had respiratory problems. She had heart murmurs and heart palpitations. I think that's how you say it. So unfortunately, she passed away. It was very sad because I just remember on her last few days alive, she was really suffering. I have I witnessed her pass out. I had to take her to the vet. Um, she just had breathing problems. It was just very sad watching her slowly deteriorate. And then the Pekingese, she kind of just became old. Um, she no longer could use the bathroom by herself. She no longer could walk anymore. It's like all of her muscles gave out. So she had to be put down as well. So we haven't had like a dog in the house like a year or so. And it's been kind of sad. <laughs> I'm just not a person to talk about animals. That's why it's just so weird for me. But in like an hour, our new dog, a little Frenchie, a French bulldog, will be ours. My mom paid a lot of money for this thing. My mama paying for it. I didn't know dogs were so damn expensive. Why? Why are dogs so damn expensive, sis? I don't even know. So I'm so excited! I'm so excited, you guys. I'm such a dog person. Like, I just love dogs. I miss, like, coming home and having a dog super excited to see you. Like, dogs are always so excited to see you, and they're so loving. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And I'm also excited for my little baby nephew to, like, play with the dog. Like, when I babysit my nephew, the dog is also gonna be in the house, so I'm so excited. But I do know that French Bulldog have health problems like respiratory problems as well like you can't really work them out I just hope we do all the right things to make sure our French Bulldog can live as long as possible so yeah if you guys have French Bulldogs please give me your tips down below so we do not mess up the life of this dog as far as its respiratory problems and all of that because vet visits ma'am why are they so expensive how come you just can't claim dogs on your own damn health insurance like oh my gosh are vet visits expensive because i remember when my chihuahua her name was too low ah! too too her birthday was last week oh my gosh anyways let me not think about it <laughs> When she was sick and we had to get her medicine for her respiratory problems, my goodness, did that shit rack the fuck up. Like, animals are expensive as hell. I'm the one who's home most of the time since I work here, so you know. It's damn near gonna be my responsibility to make sure this dog pees and doesn't pee in my room, but I'm just so excited to have a dog. It's funny because, you know, I be going to the bar all the time and this owner of the dog that we're buying it from goes to the same doggone bar. Actually, it's a tap room that I be going to, like small world. We're all gonna meet Nico together. already has his bed. He's so cute. Alright you guys, we're about to go pick up Nico from a brewery actually because like I said, he'd be frequent, frequenting the bar. So we're going to go into the brewery to pick up Nico. I'm gonna take a few pictures of you guys too. <laughs> Look at the lighting. I don't know if the lighting is too it's good for your dad, but... Oh, it's just video. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Aww. Yeah, he's super so cute. cute. Is this gonna be Nico? That's the blue fun. Hi. And this is a little lilac here. There's a lilac. And this is the other, this is the other one that you guys were liking. Yeah, he's a big boy too. Right? He's chunky. Hi, Nico. Hi, Nico. You're so cute. This is your home now. So cute! Nico's here! Oh, Nico's so He's 
so cute. He's so little. He's gonna be three months on Christmas Eve. Oh, he's so, he's already playing. He has a crate, a bed. He already has a little monkey. Oh, look at his little monkey. You playing now? It's Christmas. Oh, look at them little hops. Hi, Nikos. He ain't even shy. He already at home. He already playing. Oh, no. <laughs> Look, you have a monkey. You got a monkey. I see you. I see you. I see you. Hey, Nikos. Don't look my shoe. My shoe dirty. My shoe dirty. I like Nikeo. Yeah, already playing. Already at home. <laughs> that bed three, four times his size. Hi, Nico. These are our dogs that we lost last year, right? No, two, well, Taffy last year, two or two. Oh, dang, it's been that long. So we have them. This is what you call cremation, right? Is this called cremation? Both our dogs are cremated. That's Tulip. That's Taffy. Tulip was our Chihuahua, and Taffy was our Pekingese. Rest in peace to our babies. And these, both these pictures are on Christmas. And it's Christmas right now. And we have Nico with his little monkey. Hey, Nico. Still going. He already happy. You going everywhere. Toys. You got more? You have more. Oh no, don't get stepped on. Oh my gosh, you have another bed. Oh, dang, you got two luxury beds. You're so little. Oh, the little bowl with the little mat. The food container. I Oh, look what you got, Nico. Yeah. Oh, first little turd. <laughs> well, first little turd, y'all. Oh, oh no, don't eat it. Don't eat the boo boo. It's already cray time. It's already cray time. Locked up, they won't let me out. They won't let me out. I know. Well, you peed and pooped. Yay, we marked our territory. Okay, you guys, so we played with him for a while. It's his first night sleeping in his crate, and he's crying, but it's so cute. But we have to train him. This is, like, kind of the stressful part, you know, training a dog to, you know, pee on the pad, and then pee outside, and then pee in the crate. And I feel so bad. I can hear him whimpering. But it's, like, almost 11 p.m. I'm so happy to like have a dog now. I'm so happy. He's like so little. I know he probably appears bigger on camera, but he's so little. He's like the size of my arm. He's so cute. Oh, he's crying. Y'all hear him? Let's go. Nanai, Nico. Nanai. Oh, he stopped. He's upstairs in an empty bedroom that we have. Well, it's kind of like a, it's kind of like a whatever room. So he's upstairs. He's literally in the room next to mine. This is like the stressful part. You got to train a dog to like pee. Like, oh my gosh. But he's so cute, you guys. I'm so happy. So I guess we'll check back in tomorrow. Like his first morning. First morning with Nico. And see how that goes. I have to film a tutorial using MAC makeup. And then the next day is Christmas Eve. Girl, you guys, I'm so stressed. I might stop Vlogmas on actual Christmas. Don't be mad at me. I was going to go to New Year's Eve. But baby, am I stressed. And you guys keep saying, Aaliyah, you're tired. Yes, I am. 
it's vlogmas what do you expect me to look like <laughs> anyways i'll see you guys in the morning for our first morning with nico morning nikos you're so cute sorry y'all excuse my rooms i'm sorry i'm in shambles okay look at nikos good morning nico excuse the ratchetivities got my scarf on and everything. This, I think this is the most ratchet I've looked on camera. Say hi. Look at his face. It's just like picture perfect. You're so cute. It's crate time. It's crate time. I'm sorry, Nico. It's crate time. My mom, well, you know, my mom paid for it, so she makes the rules. So play with him for an hour, then crate time or bathroom crate time you know so he gets used to wanting to go to the bathroom outside but look how cute he is literally picture perfect like you have the most perfect face you have the most perfect face nico you're so cute i'm so happy i'll sit right here with you okay and drink my coffee mama said crate time for an hour i could stare at him all day like you look picture perfect oh don't cry don't cry. You're so cute. Morning. My room is messy. I'm in shambles. Like, oh my gosh, look at that face. Oh, look at that yawn. I know I got dog talk all up in this video. Y'all probably irritated with me. You relax now? You guys, they said that this dog or this breed barely barks. I'm like, cool, because kind of barking gets on my nerves. He just whimpers a little bit, but he hasn't barked once. But I do want to hear just, you know, a cute little bark, like a woof. You gonna bite your pee pad? You gonna bite the pee pad? Why are you so cute? It don't make no damn sense. And just like that, he's already asleep. Oh, you awake now. <laughs> Look at his reaction to like the sound of my camera. It's so cute. Hold on, because I was taking pictures of him. Oh, hey, he's not gonna do it. He's too preoccupied. He's gonna be three months tomorrow. Oh my gosh, tomorrow's Christmas Eve. All right, you guys, I know this is probably the most ratchet version you've seen of me, but I just woke up. <laughs> Haven't even brushed my teeth yet, sis. Let me get it together. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed meeting Nico and you know, hearing my little puppy pet story. I'm not really one to talk about my pets or animals because animal stands like are they're just kind of annoying like they're just kind of too much you know the people who try to tell you every and anything on how to take care of your pets and oh my gosh you could kill them oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh that's so annoying you know what i'm saying that's why i just never talked about my pets that i had you guys probably didn't even know i had two pets he's a blue fawn so yes he's the blue our chihuahua was a blue breed he's literally like oh i'm in love his teeth are sharp too like don't play don't play with him too much don't let them teeth hit your fingers. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Thank you for loving me and my rash itself. <laughs> and until next time, always remember to serve, honey, even when you look a mess. <laughs> Bye.